Hello, hello. Uh, yeah, we are live. So um, this is a spontaneous live because I hope I've got it on public. I hope I have. Uh, so nobody will be here probably because I've just tried to record a review like three times and it hasn't happened. Uh, so I thought I'd do a live one because I'm, I am probably going to start losing the will to live. So welcome to Real Magic Review. My name is Steve Faulkner and today I will be reviewing My Touch by Guy Bavley. Before we do this, can you please like and subscribe? Check out onlinemagic.co. That is my online magic. Oh, blimey. Hey, Dave, how you doing? Nice to see you. That's my online magic uh, resource. Over 700 videos, live sessions every week, except for some weeks where I've got gigs and that, uh, which I did this, uh, this week. And uh, so, but nearly every week, and they're all uploaded. So you get like four, sometimes three, <laughs> live sessions like four hours of footage uh, every month plus more and I've just done a whole new load of stuff on card revelations so there's that and they're very cool uh, Anthony how you doing good to see you mate so um, I am gonna do this review it's gonna be a bit all over the place but like I said at the beginning I did uh, many <laughs> I just had one of those days so at least I could to do that and not and then have to edit it so and this one doesn't need it I'm gonna look at the trailer of uh, my PK by Guy Bavley. Now, this, I've loved PK touches. I, I, since I've seen people do it and I kind of read Banachek's um, uh, work on it and Luar manor has got a lot of work on it. I hope I've got that pronunciation right. Sorry if I haven't. Uh, using a certain thing and there, was, there are loads of different... Dave, you had one, didn't you? That was a... Whose was that by again? Was that... Um, Oh, remind me the, the little gimmick one, don't, without saying what it is. But uh, yeah, so there's that. So, so it's a, just a lovely routine. And this is the one that is closest to Banachek's one. And it's important that you know that this is with Banachek's blessing. There's a, there's a great quote that, um, that I've seen from Banachek said this takes it um, in a slightly different approach and, and is, is great. And it doesn't say that because that'd be a terrible quote, would it? It takes it a different, <laughs> different uh, approach. And it's great. No, it's not that. You'll see a bit of it. Hey, Carl, how you doing? And I've also changed the look. I'm playing with this look. It's kind of dark at the background and lit at the front. Let me know if you think that works or is it too moody. Um, I'm going to put a bit of colour in the background, but, you know, that. So I'm going to show you the trailer of this. I'm going to stop it, interrupt in an, in an annoying way, easy for me to say, but I would like you to, uh, if you want to watch the trailer all the way through, do that afterwards. But this is so I can kind of review it as we go. It's uh, sand, so I'll be stopping and starting it but let me know if you can't hear things and all that as well. Yeah, there's the quote. That's better, isn't it? My touch is very unique because you have no gimmicks. You can do it anytime, anywhere. You can do it for thousands of people. You can do it for people in the bar. Actually, there, there's no problem to be surrounded. Right, so anytime, anywhere, do it for thousands of people. This is, this is why I love this kind of routine. To be able to to go wrong, I'm going to do it with no setup, as you'll see someone say in a minute, and completely surrounded. Now that's the, now the Banachek one. It does have sim, loads of similarities to this. That's been acknowledged, but the Banachek one requires there's a kind of there's a different presentation anyway with two people, but you can do this with the two person presentation. But also there's a kind of you, the tu, the the <laughs> I mean, it's so hard to talk around these things. This is out in the open in front of you hiding nothing. And I'm not saying a thing as in a gimmick or anything because Banachek doesn't use any gimmicks either, but, there, but there's, you can just do it right there. It doesn't matter who's looking where. And, and that's why this is so brilliant, but it's also a bit scary for people like me, which we'll talk about in a minute. I will also say as well that Guy, this is Guy's routine. And this is a routine he's done so much for a long, long time. So much so, actually, that he said to me, please don't, that's why it says Bacore Magic and not by Guy Bavley. He said, I can say it in the video, but don't put it in the title, don't make it searchable, because he knows it's his thing, he knows he performs it, and he doesn't want people going, oh, we booked Guy Bavley, let's search that thing and see if we can, you know, search his name and see if we can find the review. So he's that, when people say that to me, I know it's, it means a lot to them. I never touched. Hey everybody, Ken Weber here. 
Ken Webber's talking, and because of Maximum Entertainment, we all listen to Ken Webber. I saw a guy do this touch routine maybe 20 years ago. It fooled me, it fooled everybody in the audience. Uh, it's been sort of an underground routine. Kind of should keep it that way because it's just too damn good. How many times you felt that I touched your hand with the microphone? Seven. <laughs> Did I well, I've got to say, which I haven't said yet, if you don't know the PK touches routine, that's the routine really. You get someone out in the audience, on a just most basic. Um, they close their eyes, you do a thing, whatever it is, the audience see that you haven't touched them at all, and then you say to them, how many times did I touch them? They say three times. And what you might do is step back when they're not looking and show them where they're gonna feel they were touched. And the audience see that you haven't touched them at all. And that's, that, I mean, it's just, it's a lovely thing. Touch his hand? Not even once. I never touched your hand. My hand were up like this and down like this, that quick. Did, did he touch me? Did, he, did I touch him? No way. <laughs> and how many? So just so you know that clip back then, that's the download. That is the, it's a studio-based download. It's got the clips in it and things like that, but they will, they will talk you know, about the subtleties of, of this. And I'll talk about subtleties in a minute. Times? You know, it's good because there's nothing to uh, get ready. You know, you just sort of get into it. How many times you saw that I talked to him? Zero. 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 <laughs> so if you're looking to learn touch routines, this is the one you cannot avoid. You must get it. You've got to get it right now. Trust me on this one. Bye. Okay, so the first thing to say is people are going to think, is it easy? It, well, first of all, is it strong? Yeah, without a doubt. It's brilliant. When I saw him do it, the clips, I went, how's he doing that? You've got to remember that. Remember when you see those clips, remember how you're feeling. Because again, it's one of those things like so much mentalism, so much mentalism, is you find out how it's done and then you go, ah, oh, really? And, and I'm not saying it's a bad method, it's a brilliant method, but some people feel like they get, you know, this is a download, this is something you're going to be able to, you know, there's no gimmicks or anything like that. So it can feel a bit like, or you can feel like I do. It's called, really that simple, I'm never going to get away with that. We, you do, because he does, and like I said, he does it in, in all these high pressure situations. So it's very strong, it's a great routine, it's very versatile, it's wonderful. I always love Banachek's story about it being tapped on the back, it's really moving. And, and so there's loads of stuff you can do with it, easy and all that. Surrounded, everything. Uh, the download is good, the teaching is great. Now the teaching really is all about the subtleties for me. It would be very easy to take this and go, great, I'm going to go out and do it and just not look at it. You've got to listen to the, the subtleties, the timings, all the little things that make this go way far away from what you would initially think it is. There's a lovely thing as well that they get, the a spectator gets such a magical experience because they can't believe that you haven't touched. It's like, wow, I felt this thing. So they're, So it's a... There's that as well. It isn't just a thing that they're going to know and the audience aren't going to know. The, uh, um, incidentally, Chaim, Chaim Goldenberg, uh, sorry if I pronounced that wrong, is with Guy on the download, as, as in with a lot of the stuff from Bakore Magic, and it's very, very clearly talked about. And that's what Banachek says. He says, you know, it, it's in a longer quote, which isn't there, it's all about the subtleties, and I think you'll learn a lot from this. For me, it's a really solid routine. It's really great. It's not gonna suit the style of everyone. The physicality may not, but again, I think you can find reasons and justifications for certain things. You know, Banachek talks about the aura, but his movement and that was a little bit more, well, it was a little bit different. And I think that this, you know, you can talk about magnetism, you can talk about any old rubbish, I'll just talk nonsense, makes no sense, but it, it gives it something. So, um, brilliant. Great stuff, as always, from Guy Bavley. And uh, if you are going to share this, please don't mention his name. Talk about BK Magic or Bakore Magic. Thank you for the few people who watched this because, of course, this hasn't been advertised. This has just gone straight out. Uh, but if you've got any questions, do comment below and I will get to them. I've been all over the place the last two weeks. So I'm just getting back to things now. And also feedback. Let, let me know if this is all right. I do want all the colours back again and because um, I'm kind of experimenting with different ways of doing things. All right. Nice to see you, Anthony. Nice to see you, Dave, Carl, uh, everybody else. Have a great one. And I think that covers all of it. Let me just check. Um... No, there you go. Have a good one. Take care. See you later. Bye-bye.